Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy with Acme Packs, and I welcome each and every one of you back for a new video. Today, we are taking a look at the new 2023 Zenith Football Hobby Box. This just released last week on Friday, I believe, and I'm excited to open it up, see what's inside. Let's get into it. So like all new releases, Panini releases these very high and then they kind of drop over the next few days. So if you guys are looking to pick up new release products, I would advise uh, waiting a few days to pick those up. So Zenith came in at 200 and or, sorry, $325 on Panini's website, still up for that price. But most other hobby shops have dropped them down to the 260 270 ish range. That's a pretty steep price drop for uh, a product that only has six cards. So I like Zenith. I, I think it's a fun product. Um, it is one of those just the hits product. If you guys are into that, I know some people like it. Some people don't. Um, some people want to rip more packs and other people just want the hits. And I'm pretty indifferent to both of them. That's why uh, both of those types, which is why I do um, a multitude of different products. But Zenith, I do like the design. It doesn't carry a whole lot of weight in the hobby. Um, right now, Panini's releasing a lot of those like mid-tier products, mid middle to low tier products that don't hold a lot of hobby longevity. And this is no stranger to that. Um, again, I do like this product, but it just doesn't hold um, the same value that Prism Optic Select, all those uh, Chromium sets uh, have. But out of here, six cards per box, two autographs, including one patch autograph. Now, notice that patch autograph, it does not have to be an RPA, it can be a vet. But what you are really looking for out of here are going to be those rookie ticket RPS preview blue and green autographs. And they do actually come in red too. And they are contenders optic this year. They are not normal contenders. They are contenders optic, which is awesome. I think that's a, a pretty cool um, addition to this set. Uh, Zenith is always, aside from the RPAs and the inserts, it's normally like a bunch of sets in one. So you have um, Pacific, which is an old or an older set. Um, you have Zenith, of course, and then you have Contenders in this one. And it being Contenders Optic and Panini not having a lot of these signers for uh, this draft class makes me think that there is going to be no Contenders this year. And honestly, I kind of agree with their decision not to do that. If they do um, have Contenders this year, I think they should do it the way that basketball did it last year, where it's um, a much more um, condensed set where I think it was like 24 cards or something, but you could actually hit rookies. You could actually hit parallels on top of the autos as well. So 242 card set, 100 base hobby or base, um, 100 rookies, and then 42 rookie patch autographs in this number 299 or less. So let's get into it. Show you guys what you can get out of one of these. Again, I know I'm gonna have a bunch of people in the comments saying, why are you ripping this stuff? It's garbage, um, Panini is trash because I like doing it, guys. <laughs> I I just enjoy ripping the product. I, I think I rip Panini apart quite a bit. So not gonna do it this time. Just going to open some cards, have some fun, and probably get dusted like we always do. And if you enjoy the rips, the hobby reviews, be sure to let me know down in the comments. Remember to like and subscribe. It really helps me out and keeps the channel going. So let me grab a filler here because we don't want to spoil all the fun. I know some people are not going to be happy about that, but that's going to be your base card. Got a Patrick Mahomes there. Looks nice. Zenith always has like this interesting, you know, shine to it. And Hobby is going to be a 55 point stock. So looks good. I like it. Let's go to the back now because I believe that is going to be our Jersey autograph. So let's go to the back here. 33 out of 50, that's gonna be Emmanuel Forbes on the artist proof. So you get two parallels, one base, and one insert or something like that. 33 out of 50 on the Emmanuel Forbes there. Man, I pull a lot of commanders. Okay, let's go behind again. It's gonna be our insert, Bryce Young on the zeal of approval. That's pretty cool. Non-numbered, but very nice. Um, they added playbook sets into this last year. So like behind the numbers, um, I believe those are still in that this year, but awesome. Bryce Young on the zeal of approval. And another insert here of CD Lamb on the Z stars. And are you numbered? Gold, 
Three of 10 gold Z stars, CD Lamb, awesome. This is going better already than most of my hobby boxes lately. <laughs> if you guys have watched lately, I have been getting dusted on just about every personal box. So that's a pretty cool one. CD Lamb, three out of 10. Okay, this should be our first auto and then we'll save the RPA or Jersey auto. Eagle. Is it gonna be him? No, actually Brent Selleck out of 199 there. That's a really cool looking card. I'm not gonna lie on these Z graphs. 20 out of 199, that is a, that's a unique card. That is unique. Looks pretty good in my opinion. Awesome. And our patch autograph. Let's see if we can pull something cool here. All right, we got a rookie patch autograph. It's a bear. It's going to be Roshan or Tyler Scott. <laughs> Roshan to 299 with just the tiniest bit of orange up there. So I know a few Bears collectors that are going to want that one. But I actually like the way these look, to be honest. I think... Oh, wrong size. I think these look pretty cool. Now, I believe you can get these in different um, types of shines and different parallels, if I if I remember right. Um, but you can get them from like one patch up to five patches, I believe. And then the, the one of ones are like crazy patches, but not the worst box. Definitely not the best. Did we make $260 back? No, but had a lot of fun with this with the Roshan Jersey Auto. Brent Selleck on the auto, C.D. Lamb to 10 there. We got a Bryce Young on the zeal of approval, Emmanuel Forbes to 50, and a Mahomes on the base, and that is the hobby base. So just a little bit better than retail if that uh, actually gets released this year. But short rip here today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.